Well, getting to the NFL is something Phil Hoskins has always envisioned for himself, even when he had plenty of doubters. The Whitmer grad has been through a ton, but getting the call from the Carolina Panthers last weekend fulfilled a lifelong dream. It still hasn't said it, even though I've had like three meetings with my coach, you know, we went over plays and everything. But I would say two days ago on my way to my first workout, you know, as an NFL player, I felt kind of different, but, you know, it, it completely hasn't set in. Hoskins had to wait until the seventh round and the 232nd overall pick before he got that call. But the feeling of getting the call is something he'll never forget. Watching that and seeing that come across the screen, it was unbelievable. Like, getting that call, see, yeah, like I said, seeing Phil Hoskins, the tackle from Kentucky across the screen, was it was unimaginable. To understand what this means, you have to understand what he's been through. Right labrum surgery on my shoulder, a left labrum surgery, um, a back surgery in high school. I broke my finger this season. I had to have a surgery on that. Um, and a knee surgery in 2019. So I've been through, you know, the wire. But all of that made him stronger, and it makes this moment even more special. You know, for me, it's been a lot of lessons learned, um, a lot of things that I've gotten to do because of it as well. Like, you know, it wasn't the most easy for me going to Chuco, overcoming the surgeries and everything else like that. But I would say it's been an inspiration, not only for me, but, you know, people around me just to see, you know, that even through everything that I've went through, everything that's happened to me that I've overcome it and pushed through. So I, I, I take it more as, you know, an inspiration for others. It has been a roller coaster, but ultimately he has stuck through it. And through all of the adversity, he was able to realize his NFL dream. This journey is full of ups and downs. You know, it's not for everyone. It's tough, but it's, it's definitely well worth it. No matter what route, you know, it ended up taking, even if I wouldn't have been drafted and had to go undrafted free agent, it still is worth, you know, everything I've been through. Now, there is no guarantee of making an NFL roster when you're a seventh round pick, but the Whitmer High School grad has a shot, and at this point, that is all he's asking for.